and I'm from Richmond, Virginia, and I'm with the First Presbyterian Church. What I'm going to describe now is the water filtration system that we have developed with, in partnership, the Central Moravian Church here. Right now we see here above me is a large water collection tank which is collecting water from the existing well at the old bank location that Central Moravian has. This will allow the community to access, you can see here, water that they existently, that they are now currently pulling up through a well through a bucket. Additionally, what this will allow us to do is access the, water, the well water for the purposes of filtering the water for purposes of drinking it, which we'll see inside. The second container contains the clean water that has been filtered through the system that we created with, in partnership with the Moravian Church. It access um, for how many families? That is something that we have developed with the, the Moravian Church. Um, as I say, this is something we've developed with them. It is really up to them to decide how they want to distribute the water. We're not telling them how to do things. We purely have been teach. It's really ha we haven't been giving them anything, but rather teaching them how to develop the system, so that they can then make the decisions on their own as to the, what's the best way to distribute the water to their own community. We like to ask Cindy Mabry if they have in mind to install this installation in next churches. So um, we hear what she has to say. And so this is a partnership between Central Moravian Church and First Presbyterian Church in Richmond, Virginia. And this is our first installation. We um, are a group of 10 from a church in Virginia who were trained through an organization, a not-for-profit called Living Waters for the World. And the idea is to um, bring clean water to, to share with all of God's children. So we have together partnered and we spent the week here in Bluefields working with um, nurses and teachers here uh, talking about um, health benefits and we've also been working at the Old Bank location setting up a water filtration system that you'll see in just a minute uh, on the inside. And so it is, this filtration system is purifying the raw water that comes from the well that has bacteriological contamination. This installation in Bluefields is one of two that First Presbyterian Church is doing this year. The second installation will be this September in Mirabalay, Haiti. And we have a second group of people from our church who are traveling to Haiti in September to uh, teach the, um, our partners in Haiti how to install their own water filtration system just like we've done here. And also because there is unreliable electricity in Haiti, we'll also be doing an installation, installation using solar power. So that's coming up in September. And the beauty of this system is that we've been teaching our partners how to install their own filtration system. So when we leave tomorrow, they understand how to operate it, how to find parts if something should break. And, it's, um, and that is the reason why this program has been successful. It was started in the early 90s, and, and there have been over 300 installations of living waters filtration systems throughout the world. Continue listening to Bluefields Creole News for more information about water systems in Bluefields. Thank you very much.